California's first district is filled with natural beauty, hardworking people, and neighbors who unify in times of celebration and crisis. But we're losing multi-generational family farms, and our rural communities are drying up and blowing away. People in this district feel forgotten and left behind because we have been. Corruption and lobbyist money is poisoning our district. My name is Audrey Denny, and I'm running for Congress. A year ago, I looked around my community and I saw people struggling to make it paycheck to paycheck. I saw a broken healthcare system and a representative who did nothing, who voted for a massive tax giveaway for corporations and the wealthiest among us. That's when I decided to step into politics. I was born the youngest of three daughters on a family farm in California. We faced many health challenges. My dad, a Vietnam veteran, lived with PTSD for 36 years before it was diagnosed. Both my parents survived cancer. A few weeks ago, my doctor discovered a tumor on my ovary the size of a football. It was benign, but I had to travel hours and hours to find a doctor who could perform the surgery. And I was equally afraid that I might have cancer as the fact that the surgery could have bankrupted me. I know how broken the system is. In fact, a lot of us do. Women in Sierra and Modoc counties have to travel for hours just to give birth in a hospital. We deserve better. We deserve a representative who will fight for us, not lobbyists. It's time we asked ourselves, who is our democracy working for? Because it's not the people. While corporations and special interests have been able to buy a bigger and bigger voice in the North State, our voice is getting smaller and smaller. It's time we brought back the voice of the working class to politics. It's time we had Medicare for all, rural access to women's health services, and campaign finance reform. It's time we had integrity in Congress. Vote Audrey Denny on November 6th.